How's everybody doing? Thanks for joining me. Welcome back. Today I'm doing a shout out and also I'm going to be doing the review and discussion of the Tria Age Defying Eye Wrinkle Corrector Laser. So if you guys would like to hear more about this product and hear who the shout out is, keep on watching. All right, so first for the shout out Saturday, um, the young lady that we have today, her name is uh, Kimberly Deacher. Now I'm pretty new to her, so I don't quite know a lot about her or her channel. Um, definitely her channel is uh, beauty related for sure. She seems very enthusiastic, you know, how like how most of us are with our makeup and everything. So she seems very enthusiastic with her makeup. Um, I just watched a video with her. She got products from the, uh, what is it? The 21 days of beauty or something, you know, from the Alta deals and sales that are going on. So she was sharing some of the products that she got. And also previously, right before that, cause I would watch that video. She was sharing her thoughts on, uh, in a drugstore, like three palettes that she thought was just okay and then three palettes that she thought was pretty good. I'll put a link down below to her channel. Please go check her out and show her some love and uh, maybe subscribe if you like, give her a thumbs up. So I'll put the link down below to her channel. Please go and check her out and show her some love. The next thing I'm going to talk about is how I came about this was I went on House Party, which I will put a link down to House Party. I think it's only for US only that can join. It's not just for beauty products, it's also for other items. And basically, uh, for some of them, you can have a house party and have some company over. People can try some of the products out with you, or you know, you share your opinion with everybody. And then there's Chatterbox on there. There's a thing called Chatterbox, which that's what I ended up involved in with this product here, the eye correcting, the wrinkle correcting laser system from Tria. What they what, what it was is they sent me these three products here. They sent me the system itself. Then they sent me some of the towelettes, these cloths, um, laser prep cleansing cloths. They sent me these as well as they sent me this is the Nourishing Eye Renewal Cream. They sent me this. And looking on their site, if you got all this together, it is $267. They do have a set where you can get these all together. And then if you were to get the system itself, it was, I believe, $224 or something like that just for the system itself. Now I do know like QVC, I believe, has it. What you do is before you even do the system, you want to make sure that all, you know, your makeup and everything is removed. Cleanse your face really good. Make sure it's cleansed really good. And then, of course, let it dry. Let it do its thing. Make sure, you know, give a few minutes. That's what I usually was doing. And then they give you these here, the laser prep cleansing cloths right here. And uh, you'll see a video. I'll prop up a video here soon. I just used around the eye area to get it all prepped and ready. Let this dry after I did that. And then with the system, it comes in a nice, nice box and you pull this thing up and there's your system. It's setting right in there. Underneath this part, when you take your system out is a booklet on more things about, about the product. And then underneath this part here is your adapter right here. here you go. So that's for your charger. And then yes, here is the system itself. It's very cute, very little. It's pretty comfortable in holding it this way. So, and I I did see, cause this is purple. I was like, oh, super cute. I admit I was quite nervous at first because knowing it's laser and all that kind of stuff, I've never worked with one of these, you know? Um, and I'm sure there's several of you guys out there who have never worked with one of those. So let's go ahead and discuss what it's supposed to do. So this system here is only for the eye area. You can't do it anywhere else on your face. It's only specifically um, for the eye area itself. First, you don't want to put it like on your eyelids. You don't want to put it directly into your eye because we're talking it is a laser treatment. 
you will put it more like where your crows the crow's feet like kind of start forming like in the corner here which you will see the demonstration like I said and then I usually work down down along here I don't go directly under the eye here I go down more here along near the cheekbone area and then work up through and you kind of just do in circular circular movements while you're doing it so the laser itself it deeply penetrates okay down into your skin like under your skin to help reboost and renew cell to reboost the cell renewal system part like where it helps produce collagen it's supposed to help pump up the skin and kind of wake all that up like after a while we lose our collagen we lose you know our firmness you know as we get older 85 percent of people have said that they've seen a difference with their fine lines and their wrinkles you know how it is like now in these days where you know people can go into a doctor's office and they get these laser treatments done on their face around their eyes and just you know uh, this is something that you can do at home. They do have a whole face system. They do have one. Of course, I haven't tried that one. This one's just for the eyes, but you know, it's different. It's new and you can just do it at home instead of going into the doctor's office and having them do it. You can just do this at home. It's a good thing, you know, really in a sense that you don't have to pay all that money for each treatment when you're going into the doctors. Whether theirs is, is better, like the final outcome of it all whether it's better and there's a difference between this and that i can't testify to that i can't say for sure because obviously i've never went into a doctor's office and got it done but it is something to think about if that was something on your list that you want to get done you wanted to get some laser treatments done and maybe you're tired of the wrinkles around your eyes and the fine lines or something like that. Maybe you've tried other products, um, creams and different things and nothing seems to be, you know, kind of giving you what you're looking for and you're happy with. This would be something that maybe you guys would be interested in looking into and getting and trying it out and see, you know, if you, if yourself, you see a difference. When you turn the system on, there's a little button on the very top up here. You'll click it on and you should see this green light. This green light, a steady green light, means it's ready, set to go. If it's blinking, I believe it tells you different things. I think if it's blinking the green light, I think it means it needs charged. So if this was blinking, I would know, okay, it needs charged today. I'll have to go ahead and charge it. See how it turns purple? See the purple? It changes. When it turns purple, the light turns purple, that's when you know that it's in contact along with your eye and on your skin. But like it will stay steady. You'll see it'll stay steady. And when you're moving, okay, now if you're not in contact, it'll stop right away and it'll turn green. So if you're going along here and let's say, you know, it will stop every so often, it will turn green so you don't lose out on the full effect when you're trying to work it and glide it along your eye area. It's a two minute process, but it's like one minute on each eye. So you do one eye for one minute and then the other one for a minute. It will automatically stop. It will do a uh, noise. It does a noise. You'll hear it um, and it will let you know, okay, that session's done. Go to the next eye. It's important for each session to like I use a Q-tip. A just a, not a wet q-tip just a dry q-tip or a good cloth that you have a clean good cloth not you know just any good clean cloth and wipe this off after the use after you use it it's important to do that I'm just going to say this much this is not going to totally be for everybody it, in particular especially especially there is discomfort from doing it and what I mean by that, it's not like excruci excruciating, painful, or anything like that by no means. I don't feel so. What this feels like to me, in my opinion, like whenever I'm doing it along the eye area, it feels like a bunch of prickly needles or bee stings or something like that continuously going along whenever you're doing it. So it, there is discomfort 
with this. Mind you, it is, we're talking, it's laser treatment. So it is going to have discomfort to it. It's not going to be something that's going to be, you know, oh, wonderful, amazing kind of a thing. Now, once you get used to it, because I'm used to it now and everything, um, it's just kind of relaxing. And, and for, for me, for me, it is. After a while, it does burn. Now, the burning is not intense neither. It's not something that is so painful of a burn. To me, it feels like um, kind of a burn, like where if you bumped uh, the stove, like one of the oven racks, if you've ever done that, just slightly when you bump it and you're like, oh, and you feel that burn for a little while and it kind of is there for a bit. That's what it feels like to me. If you ever done that. Trust me, I've done it many times with the stove. So I can actually say that's what it kind of does feel like. So you do feel the burning. That's where this guy comes in, Nourishing Eye Renewal Cream. Because you'll put this on after you do your treatment and everything. You, you do the system. You put this on after. This is a nice cooling gel. I think if you had aloe vera, which you'll hear me saying in the video, I'm not sure how I'm doing all this, but I think if you have an aloe vera, um, you know, the eye gels, the, I think that would be fine because it's it's cooling, you know, because you want to calm the calm it down somewhat, the redness, because you will get redness here. You will see, I mean, when I first was even doing it, like you'll see a lot of redness here. The system itself, you use eight weeks, and after that, you should see your results, whatever results you'll get. They say to um, kind of, you know, put it on hold for a while, don't do anything, and if you want to come back to it later because you need some extra something, wait four weeks. Here is what the um, cream looks like that you put around the eye. I squeeze a little bit out, and this is such a cooling feeling, relaxing. It helps calm, you know, somewhat the burningness that you feel a little bit. You might still feel a little bit after even when you do this, but it is relaxing and cooling and everything. And sometimes I'll usually like, like that, let that all dry and then do the rest of my skincare. Maybe put a little extra of an eye cream there that I have or I'm going to use. I do that sometimes. know that it's going to work. This is where I have problems sometimes. Okay, and then it beeps, as you heard, it beeps and lets you know when it's done. A lot of times you'll see some redness, as you can see here and here. It's not like whatever for me now, like it used to be, um, but you'll, you'll, and that's normal.
pictures in here somewhere. I do feel like I seen results. Not that I didn't see results. I do feel like I seen results and everything along through here. I noticed, um, you know, the fine lines because I don't have real deep wrinkles yet. <laughs> Not yet. So the fine lines and different things that I have there around my eyes and everything, I did notice that they had were diminishing. I, is it a wow factor for me? I wouldn't say it's a wow factor. I could feel, I can, I can tell that there is plumpness there. I can tell it's doing what it's supposed to do. Um, now, there's different things for this for me, okay? Because like when I was using it, like, you know, like I said, I seen results. It wasn't a wow factor for me, but then I get to thinking this, okay? Because this is what I, was happening with me. Um, it says you can use it every single day for the eight weeks. When I first was using it and doing it, I really couldn't do it every single day. I found um, the one time, like I did it three days in a row, and I felt like I had to take a break. But irritating with my eyes and everything a little bit, like I just felt like it needed to take a break. So there was times where I was doing doing it every other day. I didn't do it every single day straight in a row. The other thing that I had that was the biggest problem of all, the biggest problem of all for me, when I would take it along my eye area, and I see other people say this too. So when I was working it along, it was very hard. It was really hard to glide. It wasn't so smooth gliding it along. I kind of came along with a technique that I can do, but I have good days and bad days. And I'm wondering, I'm wondering because if it's the cleanser and it depends on the cleanser that you use. I just know I've struggled around here. That is my hugest beef of this whole system is trying to work along here. Now I got to a point where like when this isn't, yeah, this isn't on anymore. I got to the point where I don't put it right taut onto my skin and move it around. I ha I leave like a gap in between like this and it still works. And you can hear it working. You can feel it working. Like I said, as long as you have the steady purple light on this system, as long as it does a steady purple light, it's working. It's doing its job. It's doing what it's supposed to do. That's how you know it's working. But I came to a point where I just hold it from a distance, like not too far, not too close, not right, and kind of doing it that way. It seems to be working better for me. It's a little hard to sometimes do because I do end up whoops you know kind of putting you know so it it seems like it's a little you have to get to a technique and get used to certain ways of using it the system itself would I recommend this I would recommend this to the person that's looking for the extra help for around the eye area like if you got really deep um, wrinkles if you got really deep you know the crow's feet or anything like that I would recommend it for somebody like that because um, I don't feel it's going to be for everybody. Like I said, the discomfort itself, some people aren't going to like that. Um, I don't find it to be like a huge wow factor. I feel for myself when I'm using this and using my other eye creams or something like that because I'm using my other eye creams, um, I do feel it helps all together. It meshes all together. You know what I mean? I do like this. I will continue using it. All right, beauties. Thanks so much for joining me. I'm hoping I gave enough information. If I can think of anything I forgot, I hope not. I will put it down below. So make sure you check everything down below. Also, don't forget to, to check out Kimberly. I will put her link down below to her channel. So please go and check her out. And like I said, show her some love, maybe subscribe. Also, if you did like this video, please give me a thumbs up. That would help me out so much and make me very happy. And if you are not subscribed to my channel, I would love to have you can join me each week. I do do videos at least every Wednesday. So go ahead and click the subscribe button down below. And as always, beauties, please remember to just be yourself, love yourself, and let the real beauty shine through. 
So until the next time, you take care. I will see you then. Love you guys. Bye.